welcome to the Forwarda family vlog. So today's Wednesday, so that's today, which is product review day. Um, so the product that I am reviewing today is dun -dun -la. It's a sleep sack, the Halo sleep sack. Now, so it's cool. So it has it's like the minky blanket outside. And it's pretty thick so I got this for Bobby um, because she is getting really really strong to where she's kicking off her blankets at night and she moves a ton at night in her pack and play and in her crib when she takes naps and so I didn't want to have any more blankets that she could get tangled in and things like that plus our house is like cold and we're not the one that controls the heat um, so our house is like freezing and so she, I didn't want her to have blankets, but I didn't want her to freeze at night. And so I looked on Amazon and I got this sleep sack. Now there's, there's a lot of different ones. Um, there were ones that had, they were basically like, um, pajamas, except they didn't have like, let me show you one second. Okay. So don't mind my baby's, my baby's crazy hair. So here's Bobby. Say hi, Bobby. So, you know, like here's these dresses that their feet stick out at the bottom. So there were, there were ones like those, but they didn't have the open bottoms. They were round. They were like the round bottoms closed off, but they had the long sleeves. So they were kind of like pajamas, but I didn't want those for her um, just because they, they were just thin like pajama clothes. And I was like, why don't I still have to stick a blanket with those? And so I did. there was those ones um, that I was considering getting, but I didn't. Um, and so I was like, no, I won't get that. I still want her to wear her pajamas. And so that's why I'm going to set you back down, baby. Okay. So that's why I got the ones that don't have the sleeves. So it's just like, like that. Um, so that I can still have her in her pajamas and then she just wears this. So I really, we've had this for probably about two weeks now and I... I actually really, really like it. <laughs> I did mess up the size though. I didn't either, I couldn't see or I didn't see like the sizing or where to select it. I thought it was just like kind of a one size fits all type thing. So we got the large, which is technically for 12 to 18 month olds. And anyways, and she's three months old. So <laughs> it is a little big on her, but I was like, you know, it's okay. It's gonna last her clear till she's like two. You're okay. And so, um, anyway, so it has this, it has the closed bottom and the zipper that goes up. It's the minky blanket and it's, it's pretty thick material on the inside. And so, like I said, I stick her in her pajamas and I stick her in this, um, and lay her in her crib, which is really nice because as a mom, as a parent, you know, you don't want to like, like freak out if your kid's going to suffocate at night with their blankets. Um, and especially as they get stronger to kick blankets off. I mean, when she was newborn, she wasn't strong enough to kick her blankets out. I would do the swaddle and she would stay swallowed all night. But now that she's a lot stronger and she moves a ton, she kicks her blankets off. And before I got the sleep sack, I would wrap her in like bigger blankets. Um, some of her bigger blankets, but I would wake up and she would be totally kicked out of them and she would be like cold because she didn't have any blankets on her. So I was like, okay, there has to be a better solution. And so I've actually never heard of sleep sacks before, before I like started looking um, for them and I kind of just heard about them. I was like, oh, sleep sack. Like, cause I was kind of looking up like what I could have her in or if I should just bring a heater in our room at night. So if she does kick the blankets off, she's still warm. But I still wanted her to have something. I mean, she's still so teeny that she doesn't have a lot of body heat like we do. And so, anyways, I really do recommend these. Again, it's the Halo Sleep Sack. This is the large size. So that's, let me back up so you guys can see. So that's what large, that's what large looks like. And again, she's, she's three months old. And so it is a little big on her. Um, but you know, I like how it has the V neck right here. I like how it has that V neck. So it's not clear up by her neck. Um, so it won't go up by her face. Um, so I actually, like I said, I like this for her three months just because, um, she's going to be using this for a long time since I got such a big size. Um, but uh, so it's the minky, it's a minky outside. Um, what else? 
Oh, and it's actually really nice because since she is still, still so teeny and so large, I can actually fold this up and over um, part of her to even give her more warmth. Um, but like then she can kick around in it and if she kicks off her socks, her socks stay inside. <laughs> so I'm not losing socks. Um, but like it's nice because sometimes I'll just like watch her when she wakes up in the morning and she just kicks inside the sack and she moves around and it's just... It, it comforts me as a mom and as a parent not to be so panicky about having blankets around her. So this is really nice. So I definitely recommend it. I'll put the link in the description below so you guys can check it out. But I hope you guys are having a wonderful day, a wonderful Wednesday, hump day. Woo! So have a good rest of the week and we'll see you guys on Monday. Bye!